Isma here for the introduction. For those of you who may not know who we are, we are Nicholas and Andrew DeLapp representing your ASU Prep Casa Grande campus as co-valedictorians. Before I begin, Andrew and I would like to extend a thank you to our parents, teachers, counselors, peers, teammates, coaches, and family. As much as it is said, we truly wouldn't be here today without all the sacrifices that you've made for us. And now I'd like to start with a quote from Robert Stevenson. He once said, don't judge each day by the harvest you reap, but by the seeds that you plant. As some of us go on to college, get a job, or start a family, we can't focus on the individual moments, but instead on what we've set in motion for a better future. High school is but one small stepping stone on the path of life, and as we look back on it, think about what you've accomplished to prepare yourself for what lies ahead and what you've learned from the mistakes made along the way. We've cultivated relationships, spent seemingly endless hours studying, and laid the foundation for the rest of our lives. And now I'll hand it over to my brother. Okay, thank you all again. I'll just be continuing the speech. So, as this chapter of our lives comes to a close, I'd like to bring up a quote by scientist and inventor Alexander Graham Bell. As one door closes, another opens. We're entering a new chapter of our lives. I admit that high school hasn't been all sunshine and rainbows, but just because it's over doesn't mean, sorry, doesn't mean that this time has to be scary or sad. So instead of harboring regret and embarrassment about these last few years or any bad memories, we should all look back on these four great years fondly. Going forward, I challenge you to not look to the future with anxiety or fear, but just take it one step at a time. Plant the seeds today for a better future, a better tomorrow. Again, we'd like to thank you all who have believed in us, and we want to know that we believe in you as well, no matter what that'll mean after, the, after today. So class of 2023, it's been an honor to be a part of your lives. From Nick, myself, and all the other speakers up here, thank you. <laughs>